Hey guys, happy Valentine's Day. I love you. So, I decided to do a video of, because I, like, I just went to the store. So, this is going to be like a little drugstore haul type video. And yeah. Oh my gosh, you guys should see my makeup. I did a video on this makeup, and this is like my previous video. So, yeah, if you haven't seen uh, this makeup, then go check that video out. Because I need more viewers on that video. Okay, so I'm just going to get started. Um, like I said, I just got back from the store, and these are recently, or these are just basically, uh, like, things I needed. So, I purchased more shampoo and conditioner. I bought the Aussie Moist Collection. These are, like, these huge tubs. These were, like, six or seven dollars each. I don't know. But, um, I am planning on bleaching my hair again over the weekend, because... Um, my hair, I haven't bleached my hair in, like, almost a month, so it's going pretty good. But, yeah, um, if you're looking for a shampoo and conditioner, I definitely recommend Aussie because Aussie is just amazing. And if you plan on bleaching your hair, I would recommend Aussie's 3-Minute Miracle because that is what is, like, my holy grail when I bleach my hair. So, yeah, and I'm also going to repurchase that, too, because I need more. And I'm running out. Alright, um, next two things I purchased was I needed more acne facial washes. So I decided to try the Clean and Clear Morning Burst Facial Cleanser. If you guys have tried this, let me know in the comments below because I haven't tried this yet and I just, um, want to know, like, people's opinions on it. Um, and yeah, if you guys, um, want me to do a review on this, then let me know in the comments below as well. And I'll be sure to do one. Alright, this is also a repurchase. This is the Clean and Clear Black Heady Eraser Scrub. And I've used this before, but I haven't purchased this in a while. Um, but it honestly um, uh, scrubbed away all the oil that's in my face because, like, it is a scrub. So I just felt like it worked. And it also cleaned up, like, this area because I have, like blackheads right here because my pores are like really really big but you guys can't tell because I have makeup on but yeah like this has helped it a lot so I repurchased this um this is also a repurchase um this is my holy grail deodorant it's the dove go fresh uh collection this is in cucumber and green tea um, if you're looking for a deodorant that is like absolutely phenomenal and worth the money, this is amazing. You get 48 hour protection and it protects from like underarm sweat. And yeah, I used to use Suave, but it was doing absolutely nothing for me, even if it was like 24 hour protection. And after like two hours, I would be like kind of gross underneath there, if you know what I mean. So, but this is like my holy grail deodorant. Um, the one I've had before was, I can't even say, it's like the one that has like a purple lavender-y cap. It's not like a lavender one, it's like a different one. I want to say it's pomegranate and something. I don't know, but like it smelled phenomenal. It's like one of my favorites. Like these two, like the purple one and this one are like my absolute favorite. So, yeah. Alright, next thing I decided to try was the CoverGirl Clump Crusher. And I will be doing a review on this mascara, so keep looking forward to this video. Um, and yeah, I decided to give this a try. Um, my first CoverGirl mascara um, from the uh, Lash Blast collection was the CoverGirl Lash Blast original and I didn't like it because of the brush and but I noticed that the Clump Crusher has the same brush pretty much um, but yeah I've heard awesome reviews on this mascara so I thought I'd give it a try and this is in waterproof I think yeah and this is also in very black as well so keep looking forward to this review soon uh, next thing I decided to purchase was a toothbrush because I needed a new one. 
enough said about that one. Um, Alright, next, I decided to buy nail polish. Now, these I did not need at all, or the mascara. I decided to just pick them up and try them. Yeah, my dad's going to kill me, but... Um, this was, like, one of my first sinful colors, and I absolutely love it. Um, I got this for Christmas, and it's, like, one of my favorite nail polishes. I used it for my New Year's Eve. I did my nails in this color, and this is an Ice Dream. It's, like, a silvery, um, and it, it's, like, silver and mixed in with blue glitter. And it's, like, one of my favorites. So... I bought six more, as you guys can tell. Yeah, I'm a hoarder of when it comes to nail polish. Anyways, so the first color I bought is this bubblegum pink, and I was like, I saw this and I was like, oh my god. Um, this color is called 24-7, or the number 920. And I was just like... Oh my god. Um, definitely, I was like, I fell in love as soon as I saw it. Um, the next color I got is this candy apple color. And I absolutely love green nail polish, especially like in the summer. And I feel like these two will look so pretty. Um, this is in the color Innocent or 944. Uh, next one I bought is, like, I'm a hoarder when it comes to, like, purple nail polish. I have, like, five other purple nail polishes, which is probably not good at all. Um, but I really like this one because I don't really have a metallic purple, just a straight-up metallic purple. Um, the one metallic purple I do have, it has, like, blue in it. Um, but I do not have, like, a straight-up purple. Uh, this is in the color Let's Talk, or 929. Um, next one I bought was a, the only color I legit don't have is white, so I decided to buy this white color. It's like a matte white. And this is in the color Snow Me White, or 101. There we go. Um, next one I got is this gorgeous ruby red, which is actually, I think, the color name. Or no, it's Ruby Ruby and three sixty nine. And then the last one I bought was this glitter polish. Um, it has like purple and pink and um, blue. And it, as you guys can see, and I was just like, oh my god. Um, anyways, this is in the color Frenzy or nine twenty two, and yeah, it does look like a frenzy. So. Yeah, if you want, if you want to see like a nail art video, let me know in the comments below because I can do one of those. All right, so I hope you guys like this video. Again, if you want to see any like reviews, um, I am definitely doing a review on this mascara though. Um, but if you guys want to see anything else, let me know in the comments below, and I'll be sure to do one. So I hope you guys have a wonderful Valentine's Day. Spend it with the one you love, and. Yeah. Subscribe if you guys want to see more videos, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye!